Harry and Meghan are desperate to attend Queen's Jubilee, they keep schedules free for Queen's invite. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are keeping their schedules free for the Queen's invite for the Platinum Jubilee celebration, a royal expert claimed. Neil Sean, a royal expert said that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are keeping their diaries free for the invitation of Her Majesty's Platinum Jubilee celebration which is known to kickstart within six weeks' time from New Year's Eve. The respective events will be held in June 2022 over a four-day weekend. It is believed that the royal couple is keen to attend the celebration with Her Majesty and the other royal family members. Mr. Sean said on his YouTube channel, Neil Sean's Daily News Headlines, according to a very good source, their, royals, message is this, yes it appears that the former royals are clearing their diary indeed and this is of course for when the major celebrations of the wonderful Platinum Jubilee really kick off on the sixth month of 2022 that's June. According to very good sources and palace courtiers, they tell me that they've received word get this from Harry and Meghan that they are going to keep their diaries free should, of course, they be called upon now. I'm sure that Her Gracious Majesty the Queen would have enough people helping to serve the teas and possibly clearing up at Windsor Great Park who knows and you can only imagine what on earth they could possibly offer and I don't mean that in a cruel way but you know it's going to be very difficult for Her Majesty the Queen and of course, His Royal Highness Prince Charles and Princess Anne wouldn't fancy asking her about coming over. Katie Nicholl, a royal expert told Entertainment Tonight over the summer, I think we can be certain that Harry and Meghan will be coming back to Britain. I think the Platinum Jubilee celebrations in June 2022 are a likely opportunity for them to come over to be a part of the official celebrations of the Queen's 70th year. In a documentary marking the Queen's 90th video, Prince Harry said, I still view her more as the Queen than my grandmother. It gets hammered into, not hammered into you but you have this huge amount of respect for your boss and I always view her as my boss. Apparently, Mr. Sean also confirmed last year that Prince Harry extended his support and assistance through a letter to the Queen for the Platinum Jubilee celebration. Mr. Sean said, Prince Harry has some yearnings to return yes but in fact some beyond just yearnings. According to a good source, Prince Harry basically decided that he wanted to offer his assistance. This could mean a solo return. As we all know, Her Glorious Majesty, the Queen recently suffered some slight ill health all back and up and running but of course, she's got a big year next year with her Platinum Jubilee and there's going to be a lot of demands on her. But this is where it got interesting because according to the very good source, Prince Harry has expressively written to Her Majesty the Queen offering his services in any way that he can if there's anything he can do to alleviate the problem of any pressure that she may be under very good move. Meanwhile, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have plummeted in the latest polling of the British public, a trend one royal expert described as not surprising given the couple's recent controversies. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have plummeted in the latest poll ratings among Britons, according to a bombshell mail on Sunday survey. Discussing the ratings, former royal editor of The Sun Charlie Ray said it was not surprising to see Harry at zero, while Meghan slumped to minus 70 net approval. The poll of 1,567 British adults was carried out by Delta Poll between December 23rd and 30th. Harry's brother Prince William fared much better in the eyes of the British public, as he scored A plus 55 net approval rating.